the amount of people I know who turn up late for work and all because they're using their phones for an alarm clock. So if you're one of those people and you're constantly late, or yeah, every now and again you're late because your battery's gone flat on your phone or you forgot to set your alarm clock, perhaps it's time for you to invest in a proper alarm clock. This is a rechargeable one, well hopefully anyway. I haven't actually undone the boxing yet. I'm going to do it right now. Have a look. See what you get for your money. Cost around about sixteen pounds, or just under. So it's not too expensive, and I think you should invest in something like this, especially if you keep turning up late for work. Nothing worse than having someone turn up late for work. So packaging is not fantastic. It just shows you what's in the box. A clock. LED music alarm clock, simple fashion, quality life. That's what it says. That's about it, really. Let's get you out of the box in. See what you're going to get for your hard earned money. Come get it out. Oh, there you go. So, like I said, it is a rechargeable one. That's it. So, if you add, so get a little USB charger cable. I wouldn't have thought that is really long actually I reckon at a guess maybe 500 maybe less oh no so it might be 500 doesn't come with a plug but then I wasn't expecting it to not for that kind of money so instructions I'll have to read that later and instructions again in different language I'll have to read no I won't have to read that one later so let's have a quick look around, see what you're getting, see what it does. Oops. So 12 hour or 24 hour. So you just press that and you change it from 24 hour clock to 12 hour clock. Oh, does that mean it does the temperature as well? C and F. So you can change it from centigrade to Fahrenheit. Adjust the volume down. That's what it says there. On off alarm. You've got two alarms, by the way. So you've got two different settings, which is good on off alarm two so you've got alarm one alarm two ah see i've got that it's got air vents for the speakers and you've got an on off and a reset button tunes or oh, you can change the tunes i'm not sure how many tunes it's got because i didn't actually read it to see how many tunes i just thought ah that looks ideal for uh, people that turn up late snooze and light so you can hit the snooze button Oh, it's the same button in it, so it must be just a touch. And a pull off strip. I'm going to have to pull it off, in I? There we go. Oh, it's mirrored. Yeah. So, hopefully, you're not getting too much light coming through. I'll hold it at an angle. So, yeah, first impressions. I wasn't expecting it to be a big one, so it's about the right size. Like I said, it's only about 15, 16 pounds, so it's not a lot of money. So it stands up like that, so that's pretty good. So let's see if she's already charged up. So it's off at the moment. Turn it on. Oh, there you go. Ah, so it does do the temperature. So it's 28 Celsius, or you can change it to Fahrenheit. Press the button. Oh, that's easy, isn't it? That is really easy. So 82 Fahrenheit, yes, it is getting warm. I like the colour actually, that blue. 82, 28. Yeah, that's quite nice. So it shows the time, says 19.39, that is wrong. What's that do? Nothing. Oh, I will see, it dimmers it. It's a dimmable, look. Ah, so there's a brightness. Oh, right, I see. So brightness on here. So that is it. See that? Let me turn the light off so you get a better view. How's that? Is that better? So light, light. So that's just a few modes of adjusting the light or the brightness. That's as low as it goes, and that's as bright as it goes. That's quite easy. And then you have a snooze button. Well, that does the same. Obviously, that's turned off. So, turn it over. Time set. So, 
I'm going to set the time up. I've never done this. I haven't read the instructions yet. Let's see how easy it is. Well, that would just change it to 24 hour, wouldn't it? So 12 hour, 24 hour. 12 hour, 24 hour. How do you adjust the time? Speaker mode. I've no idea. I am going to have to read the instructions. I'll be back. Right, I've had a quick read of the instructions and they're really easy and basic really. So all you do is to change the clock, hold the clock down for three seconds and it will flash. Right, so, so now you can change the hour. And if you want to change the minutes, again, just press it once and it will go over to minutes. So that's how you do it. So I'm going to quickly set it up because it's about an hour out. Or about an hour and a couple of minutes out actually. So back there. So like I said, hold the clock in. Set flash. Press the plus or the minus. We want to go plus. So 11. And I believe it's two minutes past. Or just gone actually. Press one. Press two. And you press that, and that's set. And that's the same with adjusting the alarm. So if you want to set the alarm, basically you hold that in for three seconds, and it will come up for alarm number one, and go through that. Once you've done that, it will go over to alarm number two. You set that, and job done. And also for the tunes, if you want to do your tunes, I've got it on tune six, I think it is. And the way you do that is, tunes. Press it just once and it's playing number seven. Press it again, it turns it off or sets it for that one. Press it again, it goes to the next one. And there's 13 tunes. It actually shows you, it actually shows you the number of each tune that you're playing. So I've gone for number six. I think that's a frog, isn't it? Or a toad. Ball works. 13, see? Better number one. Probably end up sending you asleep. <laughs> I quite like that one. And that one. So at the moment I've got to set on six, but like I said, it's 13. Don't forget, this is a music alarm clock, not a alarm clock. And the difference is, it's got nothing to say, beep, 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 beep. It just plays music. <laughs> so with that, what do I think? Yeah, I'm quite impressed with it. It was easy to set up. The instructions were really simple and easy to follow. You have a good length cable. It's not too long, it's not too short. Sometimes you find these cables that come with something like this, they're normally too short and you have to hang it to charge it up. It doesn't come with a plug, but you can use your phone charger to plug it into a USB, or if you've got another sort of charging USB device, you can use that. The other thing I liked about it, which I didn't realise at the beginning, was you know, how do I turn the brightness off? So you can adjust the brightness by pressing this. And I thought, well, how do you turn it off? I want it turned off. I want it turned off because, you know, if it kept me awake, how do I turn it off? And it's really simple. You just leave it for six seconds. It goes off. And if you want it to come back on, you just go, just come back on. Magic. Yeah, so I like it for, what, just under £16 it cost me. Yeah, very good. Very easy to set up, very easy to use, it looks nice, it looks quite modern, easy to make your adjustments, <laughs> and I like the fact it has a clapper thing to uh, make it come on. Or you can just talk loudly or, or snore. <laughs> if you're a big snorer, you might activate it anyway. Hello, <laughs> see what I mean? <laughs> so with that, if you enjoyed this video, give me the thumbs up. If you didn't, give me the thumbs down and... Uh, Please subscribe. Thanks very much for watching.